I'm Mo Sarji. That's how we do it. I travel the world to seek out haunted and abandoned places to document the unknown for your entertainment needs. Go, go, go. Careful. From abandoned ghost towns to, hide right now. to being locked up in the basement of haunted mansions, those ghosts, your spirits, would tell her, build this, build this. To fighting for my survival on deserted islands. And when I'm not pissing off demons in haunted mental asylums, I'm exploring underwater caves and using giant magnets to find treasures. Ah, we lost the battle! Ah! Subscribe to my crazy life to become a part of the adventures. Yo, Tom, my boy! Live a little. Sergeants, welcome back to another abandoned exploration. Today I have something really, really cool right behind me. As you guys can see, there is a giant castle right behind me. Look at that. Look at the way that looks. I have this huge castle right behind me. I'm here in the United Kingdom still, and I got the boys with me. Gang, gang. Everybody's links are just going to be down below. We got Aldo, Dan, and we got Andrew. And we actually drove a long ways to get out here to this big castle. Look at this thing. Now, it's weird because we um, expected security and cops. All we found is a bunch of kids inside this place. Like, this place is crawling with kids. I don't know why. There's a castle with kids everywhere. So, we're going to go inside. We're going to explore it. I've never done it. I think you guys have done it. You've done it? Oh, you've never done it. You've yeah. done it. Okay. And the last time you were here, alarms went off. Yeah, and you do not see extendable ladders in my arms right now. No, no, that's not a that's not an extended ladder. Not, we're we're just gonna put a blur on that. <laughs> they were here when we the, the only way in is to get a ladder. Like it, this place is abandoned, completely abandoned. Like there's literally kids just chilling over there, and there's kids inside of it. And I'm excited to go in and show you guys this place. I've never been to a castle that looks like this. Look at this. So basically, the story is is a rich aristocrat lived here. I don't know if he was by himself, but he was alone that night. And these guys came in here to steal his artwork. He had a bunch of artwork, a lot of art that was very expensive inside. And what happened was, is that somebody showed up at nighttime, basically entered into his home, like four guys, tied him up to a chair, tortured him, beat him real bad. And then eventually he was found by the police and ambulances. He wasn't found dead, but he made it to the hospital. But eventually he died from his injuries inside of the hospital. And that's apparently the story with what happened. And uh, they do say it is haunted at nighttime. I don't think we're gonna be here at nighttime because by the looks of it, we got Karen over there, just walk by. And we have all these kids over there. Looks like cops are probably gonna be coming really, really soon. So we're gonna have to film this one very, very quickly. So I hope you guys appreciate this adventure. Look at this. <laughs> this is so cool. Smash like button, Team Osarji merch, and UK Live A Little merch in the links below on my website. You guys can find yourself Live A Little merch, UK version, the camo version, which I haven't even worn for you guys yet, and we have the new July 4th version. So all you Americans, you can get yourself July 4th merch really, really soon before July 4th is up. So it's gonna be in the links down below. Get it now to help support these adventures. Let's get on with this one. Just set the alarm off. Are you kidding me? These Idiots. These kids just set off the alarm. Dude, we drove like two hours. Do you want to film them freaking out trying to get down the ladder? Well, you know what? On the bright side, that means they're all gonna leave. So if we leave and come back, back maybe they'll be gone. Possibly. I don't think it's security. Let's go. Let's go see. Let's go see. This is so stupid. So we knew about these alarms, and we usually avoid them. Yo, security's literally right outside. Yeah. Right. What door? Yeah, it looks like the alarm off. Sure. I can't. Wait, come on. Come on, do it. Was it the front door? Yeah, it looks like the alarm off, bro. I don't even know. Look at that woman. We're exploring around the sack of floor. There's yeah, some there's alarm a, there's just went ringing the yeah, yeah, there's a woman, like, she looks like a, like a crazy Karen. Karen, come down. Karen, come down. Karen, come down. God. Oh, God. She's brave. <laughs> <laughs> no, they'll be okay. They got this. She got this. So there's a lady calling. I think she was phoning the cops. So I think I think the cops are probably gonna come. But we can just chill outside though, no? Good job, Tom. Until they leave, maybe. So sergeants, these kids that were here, they just left. And they were, they were inside, kind of trashing the place. There's a couple of cameras on the front here, and a couple of security alarms um, as well. 
I don't think it's actually connected to anything. The cameras are real. Apparently there is someone that watches them, but we're so far in the middle of nowhere that cops are not gonna show up or security's not gonna show up while we're here. The kids are gone. I think we might still go in and film. We're just gonna wait around a little bit and make sure no one shows up. But like this place is too good to not film. It is abandoned and kids are destroying it and it's probably not gonna be here within the next year or so because people are just very destructive and it sucks. I do wanna get inside. I came all the way here from Canada to go and check this place out and I'm gonna do it. There's a huge lake down below and I'll show you guys a really nice view once they get to the top. But for now, let's try to figure out a way into this place. It's not every day you get to film an abandoned castle, but you know, when the castle's available, you just gotta take the opportunity, no matter what the risks are. All right guys, now that I got all this drone footage out of the way and those kids are gone, I think it's time to go in and explore this place. We've been here for a good hour. I've met some awesome people coming in and out of this place, but security didn't show up. Cops ain't here. I think it's time to go in and explore. Look at this. This is like my dream right now. This, I wish I could have something like this or own something like this. Imagine that. A castle. You have your little stable back here. I'm not sure what this is about. It might, might have had some animals at some point. Oh yeah, there's poop everywhere. Something. Yuck. <laughs> I don't want to go in there. And uh, there's like a little makeshift ladder over here. All right, guys, this mysterious ladder appeared out of nowhere. I don't know where it came from, but it's good because I can get into the castle. Oh my God. It's... Whoa. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, so when you get in here, there's a huge hole in the floor. So be careful. I am now in the castle. Wow. Yeah, you might want to watch out for that hole. This is cool. This is my first time in a castle like this and I am completely by myself until the rest of the guys. Oh my God, people have destroyed this place. Why? Why must people destroy such beauty? Wow. All right, so here's the plan. I am not gonna go anywhere near the bottom door because that's where there's an alarm. I'm just gonna explore this top and main floor and maybe basement there's a basement but no one's ever actually been to it look at this look at the wallpaper so the legends are true because i ran into a couple of guys really nice guys that were talking to me and telling me how apparently the guy and his entire family that owned this place were murdered in the house now the real story is and it's funny because stories get twisted so easily through person to person the real story is only one person died he didn't die in the house he actually died at the hospital which is what I told you guys earlier. Yeah, he died at the hospital from the wounds that he succumbed because of the vicious attack and from the theft of his art. It's really interesting because I'm upstairs and I guess this is a kitchen. I don't know if they used to just do that back in those days, put kitchens upstairs or whatnot, but yeah, there was a kitchen or it was a bathroom. I think it might've been a kitchen. There might've been like the stove over here, but I could be wrong. What is this? Room 10. Oh, yeah, definitely got to be careful walking here. So the castle is very big, so it's easy to kind of get lost. Oh, got to be careful. Yeah, it's like a whole building in here. Wow, check this out. I love the fact that I'm in here alone. All the other guys are outside right now. I don't know if I'm going to try to do anything paranormal in here, like maybe investigate. It would be cool because someone was beaten and then was murdered outside of the house. Ugh, I'm not so sure yet. We'll see, guys. I hope you guys are smashing the like button because I would really appreciate it. Look at this room. I love the architecture. Architecture like this does not exist anymore. Oh, oh this floor feels very dodgy. Okay, I gotta be very careful. This floor, oh my God. Look at this. This drywall, 1910, 1901, 1913, 1900. What the hell? You definitely don't see stuff like this anymore. All right, let's keep moving on into this beautiful castle over here. By the way, guys, I gotta let y'all know that I am posting behind the scenes stories on my Instagram and sometimes on Twitter. But on my Instagram, at Mosarji, if you guys follow me, turn on all my notifications and turn on my stories. You can watch all my stories of what kind of videos you guys can expect in the future. So if you wanna know and when the videos are gonna drop, if you wanna know what I'm dropping, you guys can go to my Instagram. Please do it, actually. 
I would really appreciate it. Let's help my Instagram get to half a million followers. It's at like 333,000. It's been stuck there for a while. I don't know why I gain followers like every day, but I would appreciate it. If you haven't followed me on Instagram yet, if you're just watching this video, if you're just tuning in, I'm Osarji. I give you guys adventures across the world and I hope you appreciate it. Go to my Instagram at Mosarji. It is verified, so I do have a blue check mark. Any other Mosarji Instagram is not real. So I would really appreciate it if you guys go, went and followed me so you can keep up with my future experience. Explorers. And yeah, man, you can just support the adventures by doing so. You don't have to do anything else. I'm risking my neck to give you guys content that you watch and enjoy for free. So why not go subscribe? Wow, this is beautiful. Look at this. Like, you don't see anything like this anywhere else on YouTube. Wow. I need to remember that there is an alarm in here. And I got to be careful where I go. Because I don't accidentally want to set off the alarm. Look at that view. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. This is a beautiful explorer. So apparently like two years ago, a lot of the stuff was still inside this place. That's what I was told coming here. But seeing all... Ooh, there's a weird echo here. Seeing all these kids coming in and out of this place today, I knew right away that this place was going to be trashed. They've destroyed it. Nothing left. And unfortunately, you know, this is why a lot of good spots get torn down because kids just come and destroy places like this. I don't know why they do it. It's such a beautiful place. Kids, stop destroying places. We're not gonna have places to film and you guys won't have places to hang out with your girlfriends or boyfriends. <laughs> Literally. Anyways, let's keep moving. Look at this hallway over here. This spells haunted to me. We got a boring bathroom over there. I'm not even gonna bother. Oh my God. What the hell is this? Unreal, unbelievable. This is wild. As if. Hey, I like this. I've never seen a castle like this before. Boring room over here. Look at the arches here, guys. Is this not the coolest thing ever? Wow, so beautiful. And then you have this that probably has some beautiful stained glass over the gears, and now there's no more glass. It's just all destroyed. It must have cost a fortune to build this. This is only the type of stuff that you get in the United Kingdom. I have a big respect for the UK now. I've always known that I have a huge UK fan base, and everywhere I've been going, I've been meeting you guys. I haven't done the fan meetup yet. I will be doing it at the end of my trip. I am actually leaving earlier than expected. I'm leaving about a week earlier than expected, so I have about a week left here. I was supposed to be here three weeks. I'm probably only gonna be here for two weeks. My wife is very pregnant, and she's about to give birth any minute now, and I don't want her to give birth while I'm on this trip. You guys can understand that, but I will be coming back once baby Sarge number two comes along. Now, if you guys wanna keep up, with baby sergeant number two and if you guys want to keep up with my life i do post daily vlogs on my second channel the sarji family go ahead and subscribe to that the link is going to be down below on that channel i post everything from my day-to-day -day life basically behind the scenes adventures um, places that i film but don't make it to the main channel i posted them on that channel right there so go ahead and subscribe to the sarji family okay this is the point where we really got to be careful where we walk this feels very dodgy Look at this floor, this whole floor has caved in. I just wanna make it to that window. Yeah, this floor is not safe to walk on either. What's up, boys? Yo, what up? How collapsed was this house when you were here last? Not, not very at all. So this room here is completely gone. What? This Actually, room here? Oh, yeah, this wing here was a no-go. Uh-huh. Yeah, this room gone. here is a no-go either too. Okay. Gone. There's a lot of other rooms that are gone. Totally destroyed. So you mean like the floors missing? M missing floors, yeah. Have you been downstairs yet? Not yet. Oh, there's a good room downstairs. I don't want to set off the alarm, so I don't know which door the alarm's at. Uh, it's on that side. So as you come down the stairs, don't go straight ahead and, and to the far right. Okay. All right, guys, something I've been dreading is going downstairs because I don't know where these alarms are. If they go off, I am running. Ooh, where is this alarm? Oh my God. I'm nervous and my battery's about to die. Oh, shit. and I'm still by myself, by the way. Um, all the guys are outside. I'm exploring this castle alone, which is what I wanted. Where is this alarm? I just heard something inside. This 
So what I'm looking right now is for an alarm. Oh my God, look, there's a hole here. Here, alarm, where are you? Jesus Christ. Scared the crap out of myself. I don't see any alarms over here. So I've been literally sitting here contemplating if I should go back downstairs. I just had to go and get another flashlight from the car, but I'm still in here by myself right now. But honestly guys, what if I told you I was kind of like scared to go down there. Like I literally heard somebody walking around and there's also like a security alarm. I guess I just got a man up and just do it. You know what I mean? Like. Hello? Okay, I've got a headache right now. Oh. Last night, I was in a haunted house. I had something very weird happen to me, which resulted in some tears coming out of my eyes. First time that's ever happened to Mo Most Mo doesn't tear up, what the hell? And now I'm in here exploring this alone, and um, I'm probably gonna call for backup for this one. Yeah, I don't wanna go down there alone. It's, it's freaky. Okay, so none of the guys want to come in. I'm going to go down by myself. Hopefully, yeah, hopefully I don't die. The hell with this. Literally, they're all just chilling outside. I don't think they want to film today, so I think they're tired. They're tired because most RG does not get tired. I keep on going. People just can't keep up with me, I guess. I don't know. But I'm thankful to Dan for this really bright flashlight that he lent me. Okay, now this is stuff that I couldn't see earlier because my flashlight was dimming. Look at this room. Wow. Is it safe to walk here? Hello? I don't want to actually walk into the wrong room. I don't want to walk into the room with the alarm. That might be it there, actually. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure which room, because I don't want the alarm to go off, and then I'm going to have to like run out of here, because I don't know if the security's going to come or not. But I really want to film the rest of this place. Hello? 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 Who's here? Oh, is that you? Yeah, it's me. Where are you? Downstairs. Oh. Yeah, what okay, come, come. I'm, uh, I'm like scared shitless, dude. Okay, all those joining me. Yo. What the hell is this place? I'm downstairs. This is the main foyer. Oh, there you are. Yeah. Dude, what are you doing down there? I'm scared because there's literally like somebody walking around down here. Okay, dude, I'm coming. I heard some noises too. Bro, what the hell? All those now joining me. So what happened? Bro, so I was flying my drone around the area. Like yeah. I wasn't even doing an actual like video. And some lady came and she was talking to Andrew. She pulled up in her SUV and she was she pulled down her window and she was asking Andrew if she saw her missing boy. And then he told her to turn around that he didn't see anyone, but that we'll go look for her. So then that's why I came inside here to looking for the missing uh, boy. Was it like that dark colored SUV? Yeah. I, I was flying my drone when she pulled up. So you saw that, yeah, right? Yeah. Did you catch that on your drone? I think I may have. Maybe. Yeah, add it to your drone so everyone can see. If, if, if so her person, son is missing? Yeah, her son went missing, so she came looking. Remember that? What's with this finding like parents with their children missing in abandoned spots? That's right. Remember that uh, video we went to that lady lost her daughter? Yeah. And then uh, at the bad place? Yeah. Same exact thing happened. She came looking for her son. That's why we keep telling people, guys, please do not go to the bad place. <laughs> you will, like, there's a chance you'll go missing, and then your parents are going to come looking for you, and... Okay, listen, we have a bigger danger here. I was walking by here by myself. My flashlight was dying, so I had to go get a new one. There's somebody walking around down here, but also there's an area that's alarmed. So if we trip the alarm, we have to run. There's an area with an alarm? Yeah, I don't know where it is, though. It's supposed to be near the front. I haven't gone that way. I've went... I know, I haven't gone that way, but I've gone this way a little bit, but I got scared because I heard somebody walking around. So we gotta really pay attention and see where these alarms are and not to go in front of them. Because okay. if we set them off, we're screwed, dude. We gotta be careful. Especially since this is where some missing children are. That's only like the most recent one. There's a bunch of other reports of missing children here. 
So we gotta be careful. So I don't know if the alarms are here. Oh, I think that might be it there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, that black thing. That's a, that's an alarm. Where? So stick your hat. Yeah, stick your head out right there. Oh, oh, that's I That's an see alarm. That. Yeah. Wait, look, there's an alarm right there. You see that? I think either that's an alarm or a camera. Don't stick your hand out too far. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. that might that might go off. What the hell was that? Do you hear it? Man, I really want to go down that way, but we can't. Let's go around. I wonder if we can go around. Go around yeah. Supposedly there's a basement, and no one's ever found the way to the basement. It's been like sealed off, apparently. The missing, what missing children? The lady's missing son? Yeah, there's a missing son. That's just the most recent one, but there's a bunch of other reports too. Okay, wait, 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 wait. That's wait. the one we caught on camera. Oh, see that? See these wires? This is electricity. Actual, real working electricity. That's going to an alarm or a camera. Okay, so. Oh! Oh, the alarm is, the alarm is here to the right. I just saw it. It's green, it lit up green, but it didn't go off. It didn't get me. Oh, wait, so is it like visual? If it sees you, it goes off? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Can we point our cameras out? Um, not too, feel? not too far. Let's go explore that side first. Okay, so I okay. guess that wasn't the alarm. Okay. This is the so alarm. The alarm here. is over there. Yeah. So in case it goes off, oh my God. it's scary because it's something green just like lit up in my face. Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, oh. So that must be where the basement entrance is okay. to the alarm. Oh my God. This is insane. <laughs> okay. So then what the hell is this if that wasn't, cause look, there's electricity here too. Maybe they're both alarms, dude. Does that have power connected to it? Oh yeah, look, see see the red light? It's the camera. Where look, there's a camera in there. It's got a red light. Look at the light. So we're trapped. Oh my god. <laughs> well bro, we're just trying to look for the missing children. Why is there an alarm here? What do we oh, do? Oh wait! Bro, it makes sense! What? Bro, the reason there's an alarm here is because of the children that went missing. So now there's a security guard that protects the area to make sure that more kids don't go missing. Or they just don't want kids to come in here and kill themselves and go missing. That's also probably. I heard something this way. Bro, that's where the alarm is though. Okay, so I'm actually like nervous because there's a camera in there. But there were kids in here earlier. I think if the alarm goes off, we just gotta make a run for it or we could just like take our time. Okay. Should we just go even though there's a camera? Like what are they gonna do really? We're in yeah, the middle of nowhere. We have a good excuse. It's not an excuse. Like we're actually missing. We're not missing. I meant to say. Okay, airplane. Okay, sir. Even if there is an alarm in here and a camera, and it goes off, like it's not cops are gonna be here within seconds. So we're in the middle of nowhere. Exactly. It's gonna take them a while. Should I throw a rock in there and put it to the test and see if anything happens? Bro, what if you throw a rock and then the alarm goes off? Okay. Maybe it's. What if it's heat activated though? <laughs> This is so scary. Like, it's not gonna hurt us, but it's just gonna be loud and, and annoying. Okay. Do you wanna go first? Okay, is there any other ways we can go around? No, no. This That's is the it. It's either there or there. That's the only okay, way. Okay, if you had to place it back. Because I didn't see the other alarm. Which one do you think is the more active alarm? This one or that one? The other one was flashing and blinking green like okay. crazy. So maybe it. this one we can. That's the largest alarm. That's the largest alarm. Yo, catch your, catch your flashlight. Catch your flashlight. That was the largest alarm I've ever heard in my life. It's so freaking loud. <laughs> it's time to go. <laughs> we couldn't even make it to the basement. Bro, it's time to go. <laughs> oh my god. Are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> Bro, that was so oh. scary. That was literally the scariest thing ever. <laughs> that was that was funny. <sighs> we threw a rock first. Nothing was set off the alarm. And then we were just sitting there talking. What? Dude, there's something down there. Yeah, um, you want, might want to come out, bro. No. You might want to come out. Bro, just think about it. There's like a demon in there after your eyes. Get, oh, sorry. Oh. oh my god, I'm sorry. Oh no. <laughs> this has been the funniest video ever. Like, so scared to go down there, and when I go down there, I didn't even get to explore the entire house. You were in there for ages, though. Bro, because I, I, I was trying to get like B-roll shots and stuff. I was on my phone with my wife, and like just waiting around, and my lights went out. And I was scared from that alarm. It's so loud, it like numbs your brain. Well, yeah, it's gonna echo so bad in there, too. Yeah. 
it vibrates in the floor. It's like a very, very like scary, scary alarm. Okay, guys, I really tried to explore the entire house. You just saw that the alarm went off. That was so scary, Time man. to get out of here before security shows up. What the hell was that? Bro, that was, that was so, so scary. I've, I've, I've tripped alarms before, but never that loud and like mind frying. It was really terrifying. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Smash the like button. This is what we live for, for adventures for you guys. Live a little UK merch in the links below. If you want more adventures, let me know in the comments below. I'll see you guys in the next one.